Hello all, welcome to eDrawMax. In this video, we'll learn how to create a system context diagram. Before we begin, let's understand what a system context diagram is. A system context diagram, SCD, is a high-level view of a system. It represents an entire system as well as its boundaries and environment. SCDs illustrate the information flow between a system and other actors. Now let's learn how to create a system context diagram using eDrawMax. First, navigate to File. Click on New and select Flowchart from the categories. And then choose Data Flow Diagram from the subcategories. Click on the plus icon to open a new drawing sheet. In the Symbol Library, scroll down to see built-in symbols related to data flow diagrams. Start creating the diagram using the necessary symbols from the Symbol Library according to your requirements. Double-click anywhere on the drawing to add text. Once done with the diagram, use the built-in theme on the right pane to make it look more beautiful. Right-click and choose Fit to Drawing to fit the diagram on the drawing page. Navigate to Page Layout and choose the white color under Background. Go to the View tab. Click on the From Current Page icon to view the diagram in a single frame. Now let's see a few examples of system context diagrams that are already available in eDrawMax. This is a data management flowchart example. Here's an example for handling bookstore orders. Another example is this dormitory management flowchart. And one more example is the information flow at a bookstore. Similarly, eDrawMax has plenty of diagram examples for you to use as a resource. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more eDrawMax videos.